Hey, what's up? It's, how's it going, guys? Uh, it is turn 15 of our 1942 scenario, and it is the United States turn. So we have quite a few things. We're kind of on survival mode because the world's being taken over by the Japanese. Gosh. <laughs> Uh, the United States, they had 80 IPCs. They're going to purchase two strategics, one fighter, one aircraft carrier, two subs, three, four, four infantry, and one tank. And that should total about 60 IPCs. <clears throat> so they do have quite a few battles. So I kind of just put that uh, yellow chip to uh, indicate what's there. Because this whole fleet's going to move over there. Well, most of it. So, let me get the best angle. There we go. Uh, I'm going to have three transports go from C zone 91. They're going to go 1, 2, 3 into C zone 110. And this is the invasion right now. Not a huge force, but it will do. Five infantry and one artillery will be landing in Holland, Belgium. <clears throat> I'm bringing in one artillery as well. The battleship. It's going to bombard as well the tactical and the fighter that was in C zone 91 will go um, into 104, 1, 2, 3, and they're going to have one space left over. And they're probably just going to land on that aircraft carrier. <clears throat> Let me put the little dice on that. So that's going over there. Uh, the other two transports that were in 91 will also be going in. But they would be bringing two infantry and they'd be landing in Normandy. The tank and the artillery will be attacking in that battle. Uh, the strategic from the eastern United States will move one, two, three, four, five, and attack the destroyer. He's gonna have two movements left. Uh, the one destroyer will also be. Uh, two destroyers will be joined on that battle. <clears throat> And that's all the attacks over there. Over here in Belarus, I will be bringing two infantry. And the fighter from Norway will move one, two, one, two, three, four. No, he can't do it. Bummer. But the guy from Leningrad, the fighter from Leningrad, he's going to have four, uh, four movements left. So two infantry and one fighter will be attacking that battle. In Russia, I have one artillery. He will be going into Brinsk and two fighters from Russia will also be joined in that battle. They're both going to have four movements left as well. That's nice. All right, so what do we have next? Oh, yes, from the land down under. I'm gonna be bringing one transport loaded up with two Marines. 
They're coming from the Queensland. They'll be going into 55 and then into season 42, and then we'll be laying and invading. The strategic that's in the Queensland will go one, two, three, four. It's gonna have three movements left. Also, I'm going to be bringing two subs from season 54. They're going to move one, two, three, and then into uh, 37. Uh, actually, just one sub's going to go. Yeah. One sub's just going to go. The other sub's going to stay. Okay, and I think that's all the battles that I'm going to be doing. So, that was nice. Alright, uh, so... Let's go ahead and do... Uh, let's do the CC battle right here. Uh, you got one destroyer, and I got two, and one strategic. So let's go ahead and roll the dice for that. So I have two twos and one four. I got two hits. And for your reply, nothing. So. There shall be ships in the med, the German, the Greek German Navy is out. All right, let's do, uh, let's do Normandy. So you just have one mech, one Italian mech against two infantry, one artillery, and one tank. So, one artillery, one infantry. You got one mech. So, I got two twos, one three, and one one. Oh man, none of them hit. All right, your turn. All right, you didn't get anything either. Let's try this again. Whew, and Americans, at least they killed someone. And for your return. And you got a hit. At least one American. Sorry, one artillery, one infantry, and one tank. But Normandy is in American control. Man, this is occupied for so long. I don't even think there's any French left, let alone Chinese. <laughs> Everyone's dead. All right, let's do the big battle. So I got three, four, five, five infantry and one artillery against your five infantry. No, 
now that I look at it, it looks a little bit iffy. <sighs> but we'll see. <sighs> All right, so that gives me four ones, two twos, one three, and two fours, because I have the battleship. So that's going to be, and I'm going to take the other four out after uh, <clears throat> that battle. So, four. Oops, what am I doing? Where's the drawings? I get a couple of different divisions over here, Germans. You got your little shock troops. These guys are just kind of chilling, but yeah. Got a little panzer on them. They're pretty cool. All right. <clears throat> All right, so I have one, two, three, four, five. So I did bring enough. So that kills all your guys. But your guys get to kill my guys. And you got two hits. So... These guys are dead. Yeah, I'm just gonna make this guy another. So it leaves me with three infantry and one artillery. I won the Holland battle. Not bad, not bad. Ah, that extra battleship though, I think that kinda hurt. That kinda helped. Definitely. Alright, so now that is liberated. We don't trust the Dutch so yet. A little bit too close to Germany. aircraft they're gonna yep all right so all right that's cool now I can chill all right so let's do this battle you got one mechanized I got two infantry and a fighter hate these battles because I know you're just gonna get it back but we gotta we gotta do a little song at least how about our Russians and I think I can roll this all at once so I have two ones and a three and you have one two Uh, you got a hit, but I got a hit, so that's all right. And that goes back to my Russian friend. Good looking guy, though, I know him. All right, let's put this gun down. You have a tank. I have an artillery and two fighters. Yeah, if I can get this guy out the way, that'd be pretty impressive for the Russians. That would impress the Russians, is what I'm saying. All right, so 
You got, I got two threes and one two, and you got a three. Whew, and I got a kill. Yeah, let's see what happens on the replay. Ooh, nothing on the replay. The artillery stands. Who's gonna kill him now? All right, that side is done. Let's go to this side. So let's do the even battle. One sub against one destroyer in season 37. So let's do a two against a two. Nothing. And you kill my sub, so that was kind of useless. Should have brought two. <clears throat> All right, so my two infantry and one strategic against your infantry and tank. That's a, it's a very weird battle, but let's see what happens. You got a three, you got a two. Four, and then I got two, two, two ones. I think I can roll everything on once. So I got two ones. You got one, two, one, three. I got one, four. <clears throat> so I got a kill, and you got two kills. Shit. So of course I'm gonna retreat. And your tank stays in Java. I didn't get it. I didn't get it. All right, so do non combat movements. <clears throat> the two fighters that were in um, Russia, I mean, that were in the Battle of Brinsk, they're going to go back into Russia. Uh, the fighter that was in uh, Belarus, he'll go one, two, and he will go right here into Russia. <clears throat> the transport 127 is going to go to 126, pick up the infantry and the artillery, and drop them off into Leningrad. The fighter... That was in Norway. He's going to go into uh, Leningrad. Uh, this one strategic. He's going to go into Morocco with his French buddy. The strategic, he's gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. And he's gonna land in the United Kingdom. Uh, this one sub that is in 93, he's gonna go one, two, and then into 97. The strategic, he's going to land into Northern Territory. And the infantry, the mechanized, and the artillery are going to move up from South Australia into Northern Australia. <clears throat> this one aircraft carrier.
gonna stay where he's at. This transport that's in season 63 is going to go one, two, three, into 127. The two fighters that are in Western United States, they're going to fly to Hawaii. The two subs, they're going to go one, two, into season 26. The destroyers are going to go 1, 2, and 2, season 26. This transport is going to go um, into the Hawaiian Islands as well. And I'm going to put one more infantry from Queensland into Northern Territory. All right, I think that's it. So I'm going to put these guys right here. So battleship and transports. That looks good. So, uh, placement of units. So I'm gonna put this aircraft carrier, you betcha, into season 10. I'm gonna put two subs over there too. Over here in Norway, I'm gonna put a tank, an infantry, and a fighter. Uh, over here in Eastern United States, I'm gonna put three infantry. Uh, I'm gonna put two infantry. And two strategics, one strategic in Eastern United States, and then uh, change my plan. I'm gonna put a uh, a strategic and one infantry over here in Eastern United States. All right, I think that's it, but let me count so I don't get that bonus. All right, so disposition of units. I have one infantry, one strategic in Western United States, two subs, one aircraft carrier in C-Zone 10, one transport in C-Zone 27, two subs, two destroyers, and one transport in C-Zone 26. In the Hawaiian Islands, I got two fighters and one aircraft carrier. In Wake Island, I got one infantry. In Iwo Jima, I got one infantry and two artillery. In season 54, I got two aircraft carriers, one transport, one destroyer, and one sub. Um, in Queensland, I have uh, one infantry. In Northern Territory, I got two infantry, one strategic, one mech, and one artillery. In season, season 42, I got one transport. In Brinsk, I got one artillery. In Russia, I have three fighters. In Belarus, I got one infantry. In Leningrad, I got two infantry, one mech, one artillery, and one fighter. One twenty In season 127, one transport. 
In Norway, I got one fighter, one infantry, one tank. In Holland, Belgium, I got three infantry and one artillery. In Normandy, I got one infantry, one artillery, and one tank. In season 110, I got one battleship. Five transports, one aircraft carrier with one fighter and one strategic. In Morocco, I got one strategic. In C Zone 92, I got two destroyers. In C Zone 97, I got one sub. In Eastern United States, I got two infantry and one strategic and one triple A. And then in Hall, I mean in London, I got one strategic. So. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. <clears throat> so, my points, that's the tricky part. I got 50 plus 20, so 70. And we go from there, 71. 74. 75. 82. I got 82 IPCs. No, 83. 83 IPCs. Let me know if I'm incorrect, but I think that's what I got. All right, signing off, guys. Thank you.